So I'll repeat that in English. Menstruation, it's a definition that you have to know, is the monthly shedding of the uterine lining, also called the endometrium. Why does it happen? Because each and every possible new baby, each and every fertilized egg cell, deserves the best, a new endometrium. And that's why the new endometrium is formed every month. The nature of the endometrium, of course, is also such that it must be formed every month. Karin, is iets, jy was nou so doodstel. Is iets wat jy kan bijvoeg hier? Nee, ek geniet so wat jy sê. Um, I think we can just recap on this quickly to show you what I meant with negative feedback. Because FSH and LH is secreted, it stimulates the growth of the follicle. The growth of the follicle, you see, I'm doing the one side first, the follicular phase, the ontwikkeling van die follicle eerste. Dit is een ander fase, want dit gebeur na ovulatie. So kom ons kyk net gewoon naar die eerste, naar die een kant, naar die linkerkant. So, as the follicle develops, it secretes estrogen, and the estrogen forms a new lining. You see, now it becomes easier. Mm. And when the lining has, is formed, estrogen, you see, once again, negative feedback. Estrogen levels drop. And because this drops, the LH increases. And a little FSH. Because both of them, they cause ovulation. This process here. Where does this take place? Here. And the mature ovum will be released into the fallopian tube. Some books refer to it as the oviduct. And this part here is what happens inside. It's the wall, the lining of the uterus. So remember, now after ovulation, this graphene follicle, the ruptured one, it becomes a corpus luteum. And the corpus luteum, now you see, we're at the other phase. And the, this ovulation, the corpus luteum, sorry, it secretes progesterone and also a little estrogen. And both of these hormones, you see, they cause the uterine lining to become thicker and vascular. And here you can see, the, because this egg cell here has not been fertilized, the corpus luteum breaks down, breaks down, breaks down. And as it breaks down, less and less progesterone is produced, the uterine lining breaks down, and menstruation starts all over again. And I think this should be quite clear to them now. I think so. That is, I think we now good to do this. So, um, ons hoop jylle verstaan. Ek sê net weer, onthou menstruatie is die maandelikse loslating van die binnenwand van die uterus in die vorm van bloederige vloeistof. Uh, menstruation is the monthly shedding of the lining of the uterus. Goed, kom ons gaan aan. Um, excuse Karin, goed. Nee, ek dink dit kan jy gewoon met dit doen. Dit is prachtige skuif hier, ja. wat ook vir jou die proces verduidelik. Daar follicle ontwikkeling, ovulatie, wat oorblij is die corpus luteum, wat dan nou progesteroon afskui. Daar is ons ovum met sy beskermende membraan, want daar waarvan die polare lichaampies mos nou deel is. Goed, hier is ook net een prachtige skuifie. I think it's important that we expose them to yes. as many different diagrams so mm. that they can identify it in any situation.